the Coral Cup handicap hurdle is next. The field will load up shortly. Two mile five furlong grade three handicap. This out of the top four of a judge for Joshua Sutherland. Seven towers, Martin Leadham, Jam Box Johnny, Padre Hogan, Pompey Closer for Vinnie Gerard, Bernie Hill last, John Morgan, Max Alex Cherry, Magnetic Master Daniel French. Shenchi Silent for Vinnie Gerard, Indian Coins Darren Thompson, Verrazano Starlet Padre Hogan, Dodgy Mistress Graham Clutterbuck, McWalters for Stu Gray, Mazuna Judith for Alex Cherry, Lifestyle Biscuit for Derek Hinton and Vissy Street, Matt Cooper. I'm pretty sure Max won this last year or come close to it, wouldn't it? Anyway. Anyway, they're called in and ready to go. And away they go. Heading towards the first. Should be 11 flights again, indeed it is. And Jay on box Johnny. And Max at this point in the early lead from top weight four of a judge on the inside. Joshua Sutherland now with a share of the lead in the trainer's title for the festival with two wins. They're all safely over the first. David Hooley, the other person who's notched up two so far. And it's Jay on box Johnny who's got the lead. And on four of a judge on the inside of Indian Queens and Seven Towers. And Majestic Master and Pompey Closer is after that one. Come towards the back, Dodgy Mistress is probably just the back marker as they take flight two. Mistake there by Darren Thompson's Indian Queens. See that one just lose its place temporarily, but Padraig Hogan's Jam Box Johnny in the lead. Padraig already had a winner today. With Magnetic Master in second and then Seven Towers in third. Four of the judges fourth. Then comes Pompey Closer and Max, Indian Queens and McWalters. The Verrazano Starlet and Lifestyle Biscuit next. The Dodgy Mistress and Mazuna Judith. A rare hold up horse for John Morgan with Burley Hill Lass as they get over the third. And Mazuna Judith is the back marker. It's Jay on Books Johnny. He's having a nice little jolly out in the lead. Leading by four. Magnetic Master second. Four of the Judge and Seven Towers. And Indian Queens. With Verrazano Starlet on the outside. And Lifestyle Biscuit and Max. And Dodgy Mistress. McWater's going the shortest way around. Birdie Hill Lass on that one's outside. Henchy Silent is being scrubbed along towards the back. Vissy Street and Mizuna Judith are the back too. As they step over the flock, that'll be the last one next time round. Jay and Box Jolly. Clear by four, racing uphill. And four of the judges still second, the top weight. And Pompey Closer is third, Magnetic Master fourth. Queens and Seven Towers next in. She's silent and McWater's getting closer. Verrazano Starlet, the stable companion of the leader. Also going well as they get over flight six. Yeah, Mizuna Judith just struggling a little bit out the back now. Nothing's got to within three or four lengths of Jambox Jolly yet. And Indian Queens and Pompey closer and four of the judge are trying. In seven towers and Senshi side up McWaters is after that one. Dodgy Mistress is getting closer, so to his Max and Vissy Street's also moving through the field nicely as the leader comes back to the pack. And Indian Queens on the outside has come through the challenge and maybe just in the lead. Seven Towers also making an early move. Uh, as Fall of the Judge tries to cover those moves. Vissy Street, the one who's made significant progress through into a challenging position in the red jacket. The Vinnie Gerard pair, Senchi Sorrent and Pompey Closer are also up there as well. But it's Jam Box Johnny's regained the lead again after just being given a little bit of a mid race breather. Indian Queens challenging in second. Four of the judges move through into third. Pompey Closer on the inside of Seven Towers. Senchi Silent, Vissy Street, and Dodgy Mistress are next. Maybe between these, although Max is trying to run on from the back, so too is Verrazano Starlet. They've still got. 
best part of three and a half furlongs to race and they've got three more flights to get over this is a third last and Jam Books Jolly landed in the lead from Indian Queens Pompey Closer and Chenchi Silent then comes four of the judge Lifestyle Biscuit and Dodgy Mistress trying to get into it Seven Towers is looking beaten now Max has got a lot of work to do so is Verrazano Starlet over the second last and Jam Books Jolly continuing the lead from Chenchi Silent who's gone into second then comes Pompey Closer in third four of the judges back in fourth Seven Towers is trying to run on again also coming through again now dodgy mistress they've still got a flight to take and a furlong to go but it's Chenchi Silent who's got into the lead from four of the judges and moves into second Chenchi Silent looking like it's only got to jump the last gets over it nicely but here comes four of the judges four of the judges eating up the ground but Chenchi Silent is going to hang on and it's a winner for Vinnie Gerard at the Cheltenham Festival Chenchi Silent takes it four of the judges second Indian Queens Pompey closer giant box jolly after that one and Vinnie Gerard. It's a winner with Chenchi Silent. Four of the judge second. Indian Queens third. So Chenchi Silent the winner from Vinnie Gerard. Four of the judge second for Joshua Silver and Indian Queens Darren Thompson was third. Pompey closer for Vinnie Gerard again was fourth. And Seven Towers for Martin Lydon was fifth. <laughs>